Um, next tune is uh, is called Brown Boots. This one, you know, it's kind of funny how this one kind of just came up about came about because I, I didn't really plan on like releasing it or do anything with it, and then I don't know, I was just kind of playing around with it at my studio, and then I just started playing with you know, it's like Mad Scientist Day or something in the in the Corey studio, and um, just started playing with some synthesizers and all that stuff, and then it just kind of kind of kept going and kept going and um you know it turned out what it is you know what you're going to hear in about two seconds as far as the the story behind the song um i don't know i was a blue collar man for a lot of years my dad was a blue collar man he had his own mechanic shop for you know the only thing he ever knew he never had a boss um his entire life um other than his dad you know, and this is up until a couple of years ago. He's kind of in a retirement phase, and he's kind of like um, working part time now. But uh, but yeah, imagine that not having a boss your entire entire life. You know, you're the boss, or it was just your dad when you were younger. Because basically, um, I think my grandpa handed him a wrench when he was like ten. <laughs> you know, and uh, put him to work. You know, I've heard all the stories. Believe me. Um, but anyway, this is, uh, but I was a blue collar man. I worked in a foundry and, um, you know, I know how it is, um, to work your ass off. Like literally, um, I would, I would sweat this foundry. I mean, literally it was, it was way in the hundred, hundreds of degrees during the day. I mean, you're pulling, pouring molten iron on a hundred degree day. And, um, you know what? You could drink two gallons of water and, and you'll never take a leak, <laughs> you know, cause it's just coming right out of you. And you're busting your ass. So I, I did that for a good three years. And um, this whole Brown Boots song is just kind of um, me thinking about that and and thinking about my dad and thinking about a lot of my friends and a lot of the people that I know out there. I work hard every day, you know, and it's like we, we're like really quick to, you know, put a lot of these, you know, athletes and celebrities on the stage these days and you know on the pedestal and worship them and look to them and all this stuff but you know god it just feels kind of feels dirty to me especially when you know you have um dudes like you know the character in the song who's out there just busting his ass you know they don't do it for fanfare they do it because they have to they have to put food on the table and uh and you know you know how the story goes um, so yeah, so this was kind of like my, uh, my ode to them, you know, to all the blue collar people out there that are, that are working hard and, um, I hope you like it. This one's called, uh, Brown Boots. Check it out. <laughs> Another 
And hey, you know, before before we get off the subject of this song, that song, Brown Boots, I just want to, if you were listening to that song on anything other than like a really kick-ass stereo or home theater or headphones, ideally really good headphones would be the way that I would listen to it, I would encourage you to do so because, you know what, that song kind of brings, you know, it adds, there's so much to that song that, it feels like it's lost unless you're listening to them on headphones or really just kind of immersing yourself into that tune. So I would encourage you sometime when you get a chance, if you're not doing it right now, to to check that out with some headphones on or just in, maybe in your car with an awesome stereo system just cranked because I think then you can really you get the feeling of that song a lot more. I don't know. That's just the way I feel because I remember just sounding a kick-ass in the studio but then when I listen to it, you know, just kind of over the stereo in the background or whatever, it just kind of like, eh, it kind of loses a little bit, you know? So um, anyway, just check that out sometime for me when you get a chance. <laughs> 